Simply put, SMRs could supply non-emitting heat and power to the oil sands. The Alberta government is investing $7 million to study how small nuclear reactors could be used in Alberta's oil patch. I'm here for day three of the World Petroleum Congress, where Alberta Environment Minister Rebecca Scholz made the announcement in partnership with Synovus Energy. They say the funding will be used to investigate how nuclear energy could be used to potentially bring power and heat to Alberta's oil sector. Now, if Synovus finds that this technology could be applied in the future, it would be transformational for the province's in situ oil sand sector. The clean energy investment comes via emissions reduction in Alberta as the province strives towards carbon neutrality. The study will analyze whether modular reactors could be utilized in steam assisted projects to soften oil for easier removal. You would be eliminating the emissions because you're eliminating the burning of natural gas to boil the water to create the steam. The multi-year research project will also explore requirements for regulatory approval in the future, while acknowledging federal goals to meet net zero emission targets by 2050, Schultz put emphasis on building a reduction strategy around the oil patch. This is not about um, reducing the footprint or phasing out our oil and gas industry. Not at all. We know that our industry is going to be necessary for generations to come, um, but we are also doing our part to make sure that we are putting environmental stewardship at the forefront. The Synovus Energy Study will cost a total of $26.7 million, with the energy giant covering $19.7 million of the price. In Calgary, Tate Laycraft, City News.